What's, What's up, guys? Did you do that on purpose? <laughs> It's too early for this. What's up guys, today we're playing Kerplunk, a game that we have played on Team Edge, but Amanda hasn't played it. But before we begin, I just wanted to give a shout out to Blue Apron for sponsoring this video. Now let me let me tell you a little bit about them because they're quite delicious. No, Actually, let, let, tell let you Amanda really tell you about them. them. <laughs> How's it going guys? I'm Amanda Faye. Matthias is somewhere and Luna is sleeping. Look how adorable she is. Just sleeping, sleeping away. And I'm about to make dinner. But I just want to say a huge thanks to Blue Apron for sponsoring this video. This is what Blue Apron looks like in a refrigerated box. What Blue Apron is, is that it's a meal service that you get to pick up the meals that you want. It comes in two different types of plans, a two-person plan and a family plan. And what they do is they send you fresh ingredients straight to your door in a refrigerated box. That's why I was showing you the box. Just in case you're not home, when they come to your door, it stays fresh and um, cold all day long until you're able to put it away in the refrigerator. Like ours comes around, I think like 10 in the morning and sometimes like I won't get home until the evening and it's still nice and cold because there's ice packs in there. So this is the recipe that I am going to make tonight. So here are the three meals that they sent us. Smoked trout tartines, balsamic glazed onion cheeseburgers, and chicken and kale style Caesar salad. Now I'm thinking one of these are the ones that we're gonna eat tonight, but I'm gonna pull out the ingredients so you guys can see how fresh they really are. Plus, this service actually works great for me because as you can tell, I'm in my, my pajamas that don't even match, not pajamas. <laughs> comfy clothes because I didn't have a chance to get dressed today. Let alone get dressed, I don't really have time to go to the grocery store all the time. And it's hard to like think of meals that you want to make and then prep it all. So it's really nice that you can just pick out the ones that you want and um, the ingredients just get delivered to your door so you don't have to worry about any of that. All you have to worry about is cooking it, <laughs> which is the easier part in my opinion. On the recipe card, it shows you the ingredients that are that come in the box as well as how to cook it with pictures so if you guys don't know how to cook something then make it really really easy so here are all the fresh ingredients these are the knickknacks to make the salad dressing here's some garlic a watermelon radish which is very interesting i'll show you guys what that looks like some chicken and the kale and i'm gonna get started on making this i have finished cooking this meal and this is what it looks like so this is a chicken and kale Caesar style, Caesar style salad. And these are the watermelon radishes. Look how pretty they are. They have like a green rind and red inside. It's like a reddish pink. It's not like a regular radish. It's really pretty. Um, I'm excited to try this because it's got some stuff in it that uh, I never thought about putting it together. There's some almonds in here too. So if you guys are interested in this service, be sure to check out the link in the description box below. So bonus, the first 50 viewers who sign up to Blue Apron will get their first three meals free. So go check that out before they all get taken up. So make sure you click that link below and thank you to Blue Apron for sponsoring this video and now on to the rest of the video. Welcome to our new little set here. Yeah, do you guys like it? This is my office. This is Amanda's office. This is Himalayan salt candle. You could, you can do that, but you don't know where the outside of that has been. <laughs> now it's been in my mouth. <laughs> Tastes like salt does. I was like, babe, don't put heavy stuff in this. She puts a rock in it. <laughs> what do you expect? You put more rocks in it. Oh, there are rocks in here? Look, guys, you can't. There's pyrite in there. Anyways, guys, if you guys aren't familiar with Plunk, basically what we're gonna do here is we're gonna pour a bunch of marbles in the top. Runaway marble. Pour a bunch of marbles in the top of this. What? You just hit me. My bad. And now we have to take turns pulling out sticks. Whoever ends up with the most marbles loses. Loses. Are we certain colors? Uh, next round. For the first round, you're number one, I'm number two. So every time you go, spin mm -hmm. that to your side, and then I'll spin it to mine. So if anything escapes, it goes into your little pocket. All right, ready? My turn? Yeah, you're number one, right? Pull it with some force, baby. Aha! All right, now it's my turn. Red is good luck. For me, not for you. Bad luck. Don't take it. <laughs> oh, I picked blue yellow both times. Man, we're going. Whoa! So Already? You. What is this madness? Oh, okay, I'm gonna be easier now. Some movage. Movage? Yeah. I don't even know Making what that up words. This is getting intense. Okay, you move it on your turn. I'll move it on mine, That's okay? That's what I was gonna do. So it's my turn now. 
sucker. I'm a very gentle hen. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Just cuz. Cuz it's true? You do have gentle hands. They're very soft and gentle. <laughs> Ooh. Come on, lady, hold it. Hold it! You have to do it because he pulled it. Fine. Oh, dang. Sucker. That was a red herring. It was a distraction. Oh, is that so? <laughs> no, no, no. You have to move it. Oh, yes. That's true. Fine. I'll move it. And now I forget which one I grabbed. <laughs> I actually do, though. <laughs> Come on. Let's see. Let's see. What the heck, dude? I'm so good at this. You know, it's just kerplunk, right? What about it? What about it indeed? <laughs> what is so funny? I don't know. Luna doesn't think it's funny, right? You want dad to win. What in the name? How on earth are you? It's Mexican. What? Oh, in what language? Spanish? You don't know your Espanol? Sucker! Oh, bad one. You already pulled it. Yeah! Only one? <laughs> I'm very good at games. This is why he never wants to play them with me. Oh my gosh. I am screwed. Oh my gosh. This is it. This is... <laughs> you do it. You gotta pull one. Okay. What about this? I bargain. No. No bargain. I give you all my sticks and you take the next turn. No. <laughs> yes. You we have the same amount of sticks. It doesn't even make sense. Whoever has the most marbles loses. <laughs> I was trying to confuse you how the game works. <laughs> I will give you all my sticks, babe. All of them. I can show you where I stick it. I was Wait. trying to make a pun. In who? <laughs> I, who did I say was going to go in? I just said I can show you where to stick it. Yeah, I know. How? <laughs> how would you show me? You can stick them back in there. Oh. I didn't say who or what. Okay, babe. Which one do you think? I'm not going to tell you. I can tell you the one I know is going to give you marbles. All of them. That's not true. Yes. Literally, quite literally, all of them. Literally, quite literally. Do it! Pull out a stick! I'm gonna go for the one that I think is the least. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, my turn. Hey, you just added to my pile! You didn't spin it! That's a foul! I win! That's two marbles for me. That's a foul! So I'll take these. Those are mine. Now your turn. No, all of them fell. <laughs> they preemptively fell into mine. How was I supposed to spin it? They're all in there. That was your turn. I think that you lose. No, you have to spin it, and whatever falls out is yours. <laughs> you have a hairball? Yes. All right, your turn. Really? Yes, go! <laughs> I want to finish! There's two marbles left. Go. No, what if I don't finish? What if I'm like one of those angry kids? <gasps> you could have pulled this one. Another one happened, but you didn't. That was mine. You pulled on my turn. That's another foul. Two strikes. One more strike and you're out. Oh! One more strike and you're out. One more strike and you're out. And I win. <laughs> yes. Is that in the game? Yes. Al, look at the rules. Look at them right now. They're right there. No. I see them. No! <gasps> Third strike! You're not looking at the rules. I win! <laughs> you just want to win. He lost. Really badly. I'm not going to finish the game now. Does that really spook you? See? Fourth strike! I win the next round now! <laughs> It really did spook me. It did, dude. You were super upset. <laughs> that was the weirdest way to drink that you could possibly do. All right, so the next round. <laughs> so you have to pick a color. Green. But that's my favorite color. You said red was lucky for you. Last episode. I picked a green, so whatever. Okay, fine. I pick red. <laughs> Who said it was your turn? You're number two. <laughs> That was foul. First foul. Oh god. First strike. No, your first strike was dressing like me. Because you always complain that I dress like you. What, Luna? That's right. Your mom is cray cray. What? <laughs> That's what she said. Hey, her word's not mine. She's on my side. What? She's protesting to that. Your turn. You didn't spin it. It's like both Strike number two. It's fine. Okay, well, I was red. Yo! I'm red. You're green. <laughs> You're too hard on it. That's what she said. Your turn. You turned it on my turn. Mm, mm, mm. I was trying to help you. I don't need your help. I don't need your pity. Ha! Oh my god, it's like it was hot. It's red. Red hot. <laughs> your turn. You're gonna get marbles on this one. Hey, how about no I'm not? <laughs> Luna, if you wanna be in this challenge. <laughs> Hello! Dang. 
Why am I so bad at this? The prize guest, Luna. I win! No, you don't. We still have to share this now. Oh, share the yellow. And now you need to spin this for me, though. I'll do it. But if you drop them, it's yours. This stinks. <laughs> and so cute. No, we share the yellows. Yes. Even if I get all the marbles in there, I think you still lose. You were gonna say win. Yeah. Because of the strikes, even your no. subconscious believes that I won. <sighs> right, Luna. She's trying to give me support. She's like, all right, pick this one. Okay, I'll pick that. Okay. She's like, don't do it. She's like, don't do it. You're gonna lose, Dad. <laughs> She's trying to help you. Oh no! <laughs> Daddy loses. You have so many marbles in there, they're overflowing into my compartment. That's what she said. It doesn't make sense. <laughs> really? Does it really matter yes, if you get that last marble out into yes, my space? It does. <laughs> I don't think it does. This one. Really? Why don't you look before you pull it out? What? <laughs> I didn't say it on that one. No, you can't touch those, Luna. Luna bear. Your turn. Okay. I'm like, really though? It's your turn. I lost. I don't care. You gotta finish. You guys finish what you start. Oh, I think I touched her nose a little bit. I'm, why are we still playing? Go! This? Why are you. Oh, seriously. <gasps> it's in yours! Oh! Strike three on you! Shook. You are shook. I win. Yay! Guys, make sure you click this video right here because it is the last challenge that we did. Luna says click it too. Click there! <laughs> and also click up there to subscribe to us because we're going to be doing a bunch more videos like this very soon. Hope you enjoyed it. High five! I mean, bye! Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> We're a little far from the camera. High five. <laughs>